Okay, this video is going to show you how to set up a WordPress account and, a, and remote blog. Um, when you go to www.wordpress.com, um, it's going to take you to this page, and it says over here, if you're already hip, you can put in your username and password, or you can sign up now. So we click sign up now, and then you just pick a username. So, uh, you know, if you're using the identity John Smith, you probably want to use the same thing. Um, so, you know, I'm just going to use uh, um, uh, one that I can actually, you know, create this account with. Okay, so I put in my username and my password. Again, you know, if I was doing this with the John Smith identity, I would put John Smith here. Um, and you would put in the, uh, the password, the email address that you set up, so John Smith at yahoo.com, for example. And, uh, you know, make sure you do that right. And then the next thing is check this little legal flotsam checkbox here. And here you've got two options. It says give me a blog, which is going to be username.wordpress.com. And then the second option is just a username. Now, because you want your WordPress URL to match your keyword, like hairremoval.wordpress.com, so you have your keyword in your domain name just for extra added benefit, um, we're not going to do the give me the blog step unless you know in advance and you plan the whole thing out and you pick a username like hair removal as your username but you don't need to do that um, so what you do is just click just a username please and click next that's going to take you to this screen that says check your email to complete registration so you have to click on a link to activate the account so it says it should arrive within 30 minutes so we're going to do that now, when the email comes in, it'll have a link that you click on, which will look like this, which uh, will activate the account. So I'm just going to go to that URL, and um, it says the account is now active. And then it says, uh, your account is now active, log in or go back to the home page. So you click log in. And then you put in the username and password. Once you've logged in, it'll take you to this page. And then what you're going to do is click on this, uh, your dashboard. You can also go up here and you can click global dashboard there, whatever, either way. Or you can click the register a blog, uh, either way. Um, when you get to the dashboard, you just click blog stats. And it will say no blogs yet. You don't have a blog. You want to start one. Yes. And that will take you to the same place that uh, register button. Now, here's where you pick your uh, blog U URL. So if we're doing hair removal, this is where we would put hair removal, or you could put hair hyphen removal, and it has to be available. Nobody else has to, uh, can have that, so it's going to tell you if it's available. Um, I'm just going to do for my identity, in this case, thematic.wordpress.com, but you would use your keyword here with, with or without hyphens. And then your blog title. So if it was hair removal, uh, you would put, you know, hair removal or hair removal blog or whatever. You want to, again, all keyword relevant. So you want the keyword um, in your URL and you want your keyword here in the title. Um, in this case, I'm going to put SEO software. Keep it English, whatever. Um, do I want it to appear in search engines? Yeah, of course. So then I click create blog. And it tells me that thematic.wordpress.com is available and it's mine. Okay, now I have to log in as thematic using my password. So I go in here and put in my password again. And now I have my WordPress blog. And once I get to this site, I mean to this page here, um, there's nothing left I really have to do except delete the starter stuff that it gives me. Um, basically, if you go over here to manage, you'll see that it gives you a, a hello world post, which I like to just remove. So just delete the hello world, check the box and click delete, and now it won't have any blog entries. You can click visit site, and that's going to take you to your, your blog, thematic.wordpress.com. And here you are. And uh, there's nothing here yet, but this is really what we want. And this is the thing that's going to go over here into clip marks. So you have your username in clip marks, I mean in WordPress is thematic, and the password, and the blog URL. We'll pick this up in the next video.